On May 28th, Dale Ryan suffered a heart attack while out on a jog with his fiance. When Dale slumped to the ground, Carolyn at first thought he was joking, but then she realized he was in bad shape. I started um, pushing on his chest and stuff and trying to remember what I'd seen on TV because I'm not trained and I will be now. But um, it was very scary and it felt like it took the ambulance forever to get there, but I found out later it was six minutes. Dale was life flighted to Toledo Hospital where he remained unconscious for four days. She told me, you know, what happened. You know, I, I had no clue what happened. I was like, oh, wow, I, you know, that really happened, you know, because I couldn't, I couldn't remember even jogging at the reservoir, let alone passing out or an ambulance. Doctors performed a procedure called therapeutic hyperthermia in which Dale's body was cool to keep his brain healthy. But doctors say all of their efforts would not have mattered had Carolyn not performed CPR. Absolutely. It is totally life-saving. I mean, absent her being there and doing a good job of CPR, uh, the outcome would have been dramatically different. Dale and Carolyn had originally planned to get married in October, but moved the wedding up to June 4th, the day before Dale had heart surgery. It was uh, very nice. It was a lot of fun. Family brought flowers and a cake, and then we went upstairs and the nurses had decorated his room. Doctors say the triple bypass was a complete success. Brought me back from the brink, you know. You know, I might not be, not be alive if it wasn't for them. Dale plans to retire after a 32-year military career. So now we're hooked up and we're transferring fuel. He will spend some of that extra time with his new wife and his family. Hubert Wiggins, NBC 24.